Goran Dragic is expected to play 20 to 25 minutes per game per him in an interview done. Does that mean that there's an indication that there could be a shakeup at the current guard play for the Chicago Bulls? Let's talk about all that more starting now. Now, if you are new to the channel, please like the video. Please subscribe to the page. We do talk Chicago sports daily on this channel. It's the only channel talking Chicago sports, how Chicago talk. So make sure that you get in tune with us, man. So Goran Dragic in an interview stated that he talked with the Bulls last season, talked about coming before he signed with Brooklyn, and then finally he gets the deal done, and he's expecting to play 20 to 25 minutes a game for the Chicago Bulls this season. But if you look at how the Bulls guard roster kind of shakes up, right, you end up questioning where he's going to find these 20 to 25 minutes a game. If Lonzo Ball is starting at point guard and uh, 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 he's coming in kind of just as the spot up shooter that we speculated he was going to be right, he's not getting 20 to 25 minutes a game. Or if Kobe White's going to be here at the two guard and he's playing well, he's not getting 20 to 25 minutes a game. You're not going to put Goran Dragic at the three. He's only 6'4". So you're really looking at him really as a one, maybe a two, maybe a two if you're really playing a small ball line up. So that's kind of the question there, right? Does this indicate something about Lonzo Ball's knee being ready? We got the update yesterday from Arturis Karnaschovas on the uh, uh, um, Summer League game where he says that the Chicago Bulls uh, 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 see that Lonzo is progressing, but that he's progressing at a pace slower than what they would like. And like I speculated, right? Goran Dragic could be coming in here to be your backup point guard behind Io DeSumo if you feel like Lonzo Ball is not going to be ready to start the season. While still having him on the roster, right, you expect him to be able to get in there and get shots even when Lonzo does come back, but it's going to it could be a slow ramp up process and that could be why Goran Dragic is here on the Chicago Bulls. I wouldn't be surprised if you see, uh, if we get a report after this now based on speculation that there's going to be some time take it with Lonzo and they're going to take this extremely slow yeah I'm saying AK feels like uh, 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 there's hope that Lonzo will be back by the start of the season but at the end of the day right like there was hope he was going to be back at eight weeks there was hope he was going to be back in the playoffs We've been hoping for a long time, and we haven't seen that bear fruit. And so Goran Dragic could be the insurance on that. And I wouldn't be surprised if we do see them kind of take their time with, with Lonzo Ball, seeing as how it's a bone bruise and meniscus surgery, right? And you see them really kind of working back in slower. Therefore, Goran Dragic getting those minutes. Now, before I continue with the video, I do want to know how you guys feel, man. Let me know in the comments below. Do you expect Goran Dragic to play 20 to 25 minutes for the Chicago Bulls this season? season i'll be talking with you down in the comments as well the other scenario could be right like that there's a kobe white move that's going to be in place and so kobe white slowly phases out of the lineup or you know what i'm saying kobe white plays well and he ends up being traded by the middle of the season both of those are options right or you see you know the chicago bulls hold on to kobe white and he ends up playing throughout the season but i think that that's kind of the other spot where you could see him play and possibly get some minutes even splitting time between the two positions right i don't see goran dragage getting more more than maybe 10 to 12 minutes max like do you see Goran Dragic even if he's playing a little bit of the one a little bit of the two getting more than 10 to 12 minutes 20 to 25 minutes is a lot of time that's a half a game you know what I'm saying so I think that I think that I could see him doing 10 to 12 minutes at that spot even if you feel like right he's taking some time from Kobe taking a little bit of time as a backup point guard right and so that's kind of where the question mark comes in especially when you look at the fact that Io DeSumo's there Zach Levine starting DeMar DeRozan is your three right who can also play the two if you want to move Patrick Williams up and play a little bit bigger lineup. Maybe you throw P-Will, Marco, uh, 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 Andre Drummond on the floor all at the same time. You want to play a little bit bigger lineup there, right? And so there's a lot of things that the Bulls can do, and it'll be interesting to see what Billy Donovan will do with this scheme. But I just, I just look at this right and to me, unless there's a major trade coming or you have serious concerns about Lonzo Ball, I don't see him getting 20 to 25 minutes a game. But the other th the other side of that, right, is like we've said multiple times, he's a great spot up shooter. He's a great catch and shoot guy. Right. And that's something that the Bulls absolutely needed last season. And so if he performs better than Kobe White does at that position, right, this is about winning at the end of the day. And you want to see Kobe White absolutely get himself together. She kind of move 
and and give a great contribution to this team. And we've seen him kind of working on the handles this offseason. So hopefully that adds to his game where he can get to the bucket a little bit easier, get himself a shot a little bit easier, right? But if Kobe White's not performing highly, I could see Goran Dragic kind of stepping in there. But everybody, I mean, I mean, there, there seems to be this feeling that, right, like Kobe's going to take a step and at least increase his value. And he, I don't know if you want to start throwing Goran Dragic out there 20 to 25 minutes halfway through the season if you plan on trading Kobe White. So I want to know how you guys feel, though, man. Let me know in the comments below. I'll be down there talking with you as well. Do you feel like Goran Dragic will play 20 to 25 minutes for the Chicago Bulls this season? Season. I'll be talking with you guys. As always, man, to continue watching our Chicago Bulls content, click the links on the screen or check the links in the description below. Y'all stay safe out there, Chicago. Peace.